today we're taking a look at the top five cheap mini RC trucks you can currently buy in 2022. There are literally hundreds of options out there these days when it comes to buying an RC car on a limited budget, but which ones are actually any good and which ones are worth spending your hard earned cash on. Most people starting out in the hobby want something that is fast, durable, good looking, and most importantly, cheap. I've tested a lot of cheap RC cars on my channel, but I think I finally found a good selection of cheap mini RC monster trucks that you will be very pleased with. I won't be going into too much detail with all of the trucks mentioned in today's video, but I will leave links to all of the full review videos in the description below. So let's begin, let's take a look at number five. At number five, we have the Rolalo 114th scale monster truck. This is the most expensive truck on this list, currently selling for $169 or £138. So why is it the most expensive? Well, it's the quality. This is the best quality mini truck I have seen in a long time. There are a lot of LC racing clones out there, such as your WL Toys and E-Sheens, but they don't even come close to the quality that you get with the Rolalo. Electronics wise, you get a brushed 550 motor, a 60 amp brushed ESC, and an upgradable free wire servo. The chassis has lots of nice features, including very smooth, oil filled shocks, metal drive shafts, ball bearings throughout, metal diffs, adjustable turnbuckles, and a metal chassis. As a beginner, you want something that is upgradable, and this platform is perfect for upgrading as your RC skills improve. Stock speeds out the box are quite good. On 2S, I managed to achieve 21, and on 3S, I achieved 30 miles per hour. Both of these speeds are very respectable speeds. I converted mine to brushless recently and turned it into a wheelie popping beast. Check this out. With the new upgraded setup, I managed to achieve a speed of 56 miles per hour and that was only on 2S, which is almost double the speed the truck will do on its stock setup. Everything you need to get you up and running is included in the box, including a 2S LiPo and a massive bag of spare parts and accessories. Overall, a very impressive truck and a little more expensive than some people may like to pay, but I do think it's worth the extra money due to the quality and the extras that you receive in the box. That said, there are another four really good options on this list, so let's move on to number four. At number four, we have the Hypergo Brushed. A new addition this year and I have to say it's one of the most impressive, ready to run, brushed beginner trucks I have ever featured on my channel. These things cost about £95 or $110 at the moment, which is still quite a lot of money considering they are only 1 16th scale and they're brushed. The truck comes with GPS which is a new feature for cheap RC cars at this price point. A mobile app allows you to receive telemetry detail straight from the truck including current speed and amount of battery remaining. A lot of people left comments on the review video that I did of the Hypergo Brushed and people said the GPS features are a little bit gimmicky and I do tend to agree with that. Now if they'd have left that out I think the truck could have been priced a lot cheaper. I enjoyed testing the GPS functions but I have to say it's not something I continue to use as the two brush trucks I tried only reached speeds in the 20 to 24 mile per hour range and considering the GPS unit isn't compatible with other transmitters and receivers I struggle to find a need to have all this on a cheap brushed RC truck. It's nice when companies try something new and do things different from the rest so I can appreciate the direction MJX went with this one. Electronics wise you get the GPS unit, a 35 amp ESC, a 390 brushed motor which comes with a heat sink and a fan and finally an upgradable free wire servo. You get oil filled shocks, metal drive shafts, metal center drive shaft, fixed links, very flexible plastic used on all the components throughout the truck and an LED light bar at the front. In the box you get a decent size transmitter, a 1000 milliamp hour 2S smart lipo which is charged through USB-C and everything else that you need to get you up and running is all included in the box. Durability is where this thing is king, the plastics used on these is super durable and it would make an excellent first skate park basher. 
There are lots of different body shell options available for these trucks, and a lot of them look like replicas of the bigger, more well-known trucks out there. Overall, an excellent choice for a beginner who's just starting out in the hobby and looking for a solid, reliable and durable truck with added GPS functionality. Moving on to number three, we have got the WL Toys 144002, another 114 scale monster truck very similar to the Rilalo truck that we spoke about at the start of this list. Essentially, everything is exactly the same as the Rilalo, but slightly less quality, and also a very bright body shell and wheels, which I've never been a fan of. Just like the Rilalo, this is a great platform to upgrade and spares are readily available everywhere, as it's very similar to the popular 144 001 buggy. These trucks have come down in price now, they're currently sat at about £118 or $136. So a lot less than the Rilalo, but again the quality is just not as good, but upgrades are readily available and lots of people have already successfully converted these to brushless. The chassis features silky smooth oil filled shocks, which are one of my favourite features with a lot of the WL Toys range, a metal chassis, metal shock towers, metal drive shafts, a metal centre drive shaft, ball bearings bearings throughout, metal diffs and adjustable turnbuckles. This thing is covered in metal components and I like that a lot. In the box you get a WL Toys standard transmitter, some accessories, a 1500mAh 2S LiPo which gives decent runtime, but it's definitely worth investing in a couple of extra packs. Let's talk about speeds then. On the stock 2S LiPo I managed to achieve a speed of 24 miles per hour which is nowhere near the promised 38 mile per hour top speed. These trucks are so durable and they make excellent skate park bashers. Not a bad truck at all and if you were a fan of the Rilalo at the start of the video but you don't want to pay the extra money then this may be the truck for you. At the number two spot we have the excellent high boxing or HBX 16889A Pro which has been one of the most popular cheap ready to run RC trucks you can currently buy. I own the brushed version and I've never actually tried the brushless version, but everyone I've spoken to, they all say the same thing. This truck is epic. I want to say a massive thanks to the RC Kiwis for allowing me to use their amazing footage here. And as you can see, it is epic. Oh, <laughs> oh look at that. <laughs> oh, beauty. That was nice. Coming back. Nice. Ooh. These are selling for £119 or $138 at the moment, which is a decent price considering how good they actually are. The 16889A is known for being fast, durable and fun, and an excellent choice for someone looking at getting into the hobby, but they're not really a fan of brushed models and they're looking for a little Whoa. bit of extra speed. Electronics wise, the truck comes with a 3800 kV brushless motor, a two in one ESC and a three wire micro servo. Chassis features include metal shocks, metal drive shafts, very durable plastic used throughout on all the components and the chassis itself ball bearings, an optional wheelie bar. In the box you get a decent transmitter, a 1000mAh 2S LiPo, a black and white manual and some spare accessories. The RC Kiwis managed to achieve a speed of 39km per hour or 24 miles per hour which isn't too bad for such a small truck. The truck is skate park and bash ready and an epic choice to throw into a backpack and have some fun with it anywhere. This brings us on to the number one spot and we have the MJX Hypergo Brush now you can get this thing in truggy form, in buggy form and monster truck form. This thing is a 1 16th scale beast, it's 2S and 3S ready out of the box and I think it's simply incredible. But why does this new truck deserve the number one spot? Well it's impressive when it comes to on-road performance, managing speeds up to 40 miles per hour on the included 3S battery which is one of the fastest speeds I have seen on a cheap RC truck of this size. This is thanks to the 4200 kV brushless motor and 45 amp ESC helping to propel this tiny truck to those impressive top speeds. There's zero cogging on and off road and everything feels super smooth and it's very easy to drive. This truck is the result of lots of in-depth testing and feedback received by customers and RC YouTubers including myself who reviewed the first brushed version and passed on all the comments to MJX to make any relevant changes. MJX 
listened and they've left out the somewhat gimmicky GPS features, instead making an optional GPS package for those of you out there who still want the GPS functions. If you're looking for an excellent upgradable platform which is already very capable out of the box, then this is the one to buy. In the box you've got everything you need to get you up and running including a 2S or a 3S 1050 milliamp hour LiPo depending on which version you go for. A USB charger, a black and white manual plus some spare accessories. The truck features metal oil filled shocks, metal drive shafts, metal center drive shaft, wheelie bar which you will need to fit using the included screws, a rear wing which again you will need to fit yourself, adjustable turnbuckles and a whole lot more. Overall quality of this truck is excellent and it definitely shows. Off-road performance is fun and it feels good on 2S and I think that's more than enough power for most people. I have no doubt these things would also do well at your local skate park as they are made from excellent quality and flexible plastics. In my opinion the best RC mini truck you can buy in 2022 has to be the fantastic MJX HyperGo brushless and it doesn't matter which one you go for if you go for the monster truck the buggy or the truggy you're going to be seriously impressed. I really hope you enjoyed today's video and I hope this will help you make your decision when it comes to looking for a cheap mini RC monster truck especially if you're just getting into the hobby I really hope you find this video handy. All links will be placed down in the description below if you want to check out the full reviews of all of these trucks I'll also leave links where you can purchase these directly from Banggood. If you enjoyed this video then be sure to hit that subscribe button to help support the channel and help me reach my goal of 20,000 subscribers by the end of the year. Cheers for watching, see you on the next one, take care.